Okay, now that we've created this fantastic model, let's go ahead and deploy it and share it with other people. So there's three different ways we'll go through. This video will start with just the simplest one, publish to gallery. So this is an option you'll use when uh, you want to share this with other Azure ML Studio users. So this is for, um, you've created a model, you want someone's feedback, you've created a, a model that you want to share, get some uh, recognition for, things like that. Anyway, I'm going to expand this a little bit just so you guys can see. There we go. All right, um, let's call, uh, that's fine, we'll leave it just like this. So experiment name, tags to make it searchable, uh, let's see, you know what, I don't really care. I'm not going to give a whole lot of information. I'm just going to come down here and click next. I'm going to have to pull this back up so you can see it. This button right here. You can have a nice pretty image to go along with it. I honestly don't care for mine. I don't need one. I'm not trying to sell this or uh, get rec a whole lot of recognition for it. I just want to show you how to do it. So let's uh, move along. Come on, try again. There we go. Um, this one's going to be publicly available to everybody. Just hit yep down here, OK. And I've had errors when this happens before. And honestly, I don't know what causes them. And I've just tried republishing the gallery when the errors come up. And then it works on the second or third try. But uh, you'll know it works because when it's finished here, it's going to pop open a web page and show you what it looks like to everybody else when they search for it. So I'm just going to pause this until it's finally done here. OK, perfect. Here it is. So like I said, if you get an error and it doesn't work, just try it again. Uh, sometimes you might need to rerun your model and uh, let everything process again and then try publishing. That's fixed it for me before as well, too. Anyway, I'm going to grab this link, copy it, or I can just click View and Gallery. That should open up the web page. Here we go. Here's my experiment. I can still go in and edit it and change the name uh, if I want to. Um, that's easy enough to do. Here's where somebody else can download it add it to their own uh, Visual Studio and use it there. Uh, that's publishing it to the gallery. So again, this just makes it available to other users of Azure ML Studio.